All right, let's go meet Dutch at the station. Hey, I think Mrs. Adler should be our tag along. Not Lenny or Micah. Mrs. Adler is a badass. How are you, boy? I love Mrs. Adler. Fuck uh, Mary Linton. Let me run away with Mrs. Adler. Okay. This is a trap? I bet this is a trap. Wow, that lady sure can scream. That's an alligator. Welcome. Would you please get them out of here? I can't stand a touching, and I don't want to ride in doors. Sure. Yeah, I'll just pick up and I'll save your life, then also clean up your house. That's exactly what I'll, I'm here to do. Just one more. Yes, that happens when there's two, and you pick up one. Quick maths. Two minus one is one. Quick maths. Now let's go to Dutch. Rob this trolley station. My pants don't really match the rest of my outfit. My boots are nice, though. Out of the damn way. Yeah, that's a, I was actually just going to say the same thing. I didn't get you all dolled up, horsey, so you could walk around. Did that guy just say, I'm not a hater, I'm a racist? Is that what he just said? Is that what I just heard? Made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are going to... We look so place. conspicuous. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I have noticed. I want to just run away from myself. Show and then, look, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. This God damn it, Dutch. Check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it. There's like 20 bucks. There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn. We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Find out. We got you surrounded. That greasy son of a bitch. He set us up. You think this seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur? What are we gonna do, gentlemen? Something. The trolley. The trolley. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's go. <laughs> Man, I was wearing my bandana and everything. How do they know who I am? Oh, what a shot. Yeah, no shit. I told us just to leave. I've never driven a fucking trolley before. Uh oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> that poor man's wagon. <laughs> Jesus Christ, come on. We gotta escape these cops. I'm stuck on the fucking cart. You're not worried about me, Lenny? Damn. They the road. Hold on. Use this. 
Uh. <laughs> that was awesome. Only $165 for all those murders. We killed like 20 people. So for the low, low price of like $8.25 per person, you can get away with murder. I think we're clear. You know what, Dutch? Next time... It's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. <clears throat> thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Well, we each got... $15. Oh, and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. <clears throat> Played me like a yokel. Because you are a yokel, Dutch. Law on us. What do we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? We just need money. One more decent take and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Jose agrees. Even after that, especially after that. I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on, I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, you can't win them all. I like your attitude, Lenny. Fifteen dollars and thirty-three cents. Awesome. I can't even pay off my fucking bounty. I'm gonna lose $150 on that job. Wait, is this train being robbed? Indeed. Fuck the O'Driscolls. Hey, Ah, people like us. We're the friendliest, friendly neighborhood cowboy man. You hear about the massacre? Be seeing you. I knew a fellow who worked there for a while. You hear about the massacre? Yeah, I caused the massacre. There's the files in the office above the refinery room. It's that window with the blind drawn up. I see. If the files are as incriminating as we believe, Mr. Cornwall's men will destroy them if they know you're coming. There's only one of me, son. I don't intend for them to know I'm coming. What will the files say? There'll be a report from Leyland Oil Development Company. Uh-oh. You got the money? Yes. Any ideas how I sneak into this place? You could crawl under the fence or hide in the wagon. They keep rolling in. I'll go take a look. If there's a problem, call for me. I thought the whole point was that this had nothing to do with you. Ideally. That you, Al? Hey, I robbed this place once before. Pick it up. We are the sneakiest man in the world. The sneakiest. Let's go get him. Now stay quiet. Or head office will send me back to get you. Oh, yep. Head office will. Oh, it was a slide. 
Weapons on the ground and hands in the air. Ah, shit. Now, we won't tell you again. Oh boy! Hey there! Yeah, we do need to go. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Come on, eagle flies. We gotta get out of here. you wasn't getting involved thought you were gonna enter and leave silently thank you you saved my life thank you I hope well I don't know what I hope but who knows maybe these will be of some use here's your money thank you oh dang I really have to give the gang some of my money? That's crap. <laughs> 